kind of frustrating day defensively. Just couldn't, couldn't get a pass rush going. I know, you know, that's got to be frustrating. Did that kind of surprise you? And did that, did that kind of start kind of the, the dominoes a little bit where they were able to get some, you know, expose some coverage stuff? Just what, what, was your, what were your thoughts defensively today? I don't know. I'm not going to really point to anyone. You know, we all could have done our, our individual jobs a lot better than what we did. Um, you know, personal foul penalties when they're getting off the field on third down, things like that. We shoot you in the foot, and um, they did today. So um, I'm not going to point any fingers. Like I said, we, we all need to get better collectively, and you know, um, we'll get we'll get ready uh, this next week. Seeing this team, you know, being able to you know get a push up front, was it kind of even was it surprising to you that you got, you couldn't get a lot of pressure on the quarterback today? I mean. I don't know. They, their quarterback was, he got rid of the ball pretty fast, too, um, sometimes. And, I mean, I, don't, I would <clears throat> say I was, you know, obviously, we want our D-line to have more pressure always, but, um, you know, there comes a time where you're going to face adversity and there's going to be guys that are pretty good up front and just, just to get game of football and how you respond to it just, you know, says a lot about how, who you are. And, uh, you know, our D-line, they, it's not like they didn't work hard and didn't try to get the pass rush, so um, I, mean, I still love them. Logan, you guys got that safety, and then you got a couple of turnovers. That seemed to get you guys going. Was there something Washington State adjusted to second half wise that you could tell uh, from what they were doing? Not really. I mean, they were doing everything we expected them to do. Um, it just came down to us not executing the best of our ability, and, um, and really that was it. Feel you know the next game is SEC team. I guess whether it's Missouri or whoever else is just is it just get ready for the next thing. You feel like you guys will. Learn and bounce back from this one. Yeah, I mean we're going to be uh, pretty mad about this one for a couple of days, but come Monday we got to move on. I mean you just you have to put this stuff in the rearview mirror, learn from it, um, take what you can from it, and uh, move forward. And we still have a lot of season left to play. So, look, I mean you guys go into halftime, a couple big stops, you get the turnovers, the safety, and really kind of shut them down going into half. At that point, were you guys? thinking like we've got momentum and we, we've got their game plan figured out and we, we got them where we like them? I mean, yeah, of course, but you know, they're always going to come out with adjustments at halftime. That's what teams do. Going to the locker room, they always figure out ways to um, make you adjust from the opposite side of the ball. And um, like I said, we just really didn't execute the best that we could um, as a whole defensive unit, I don't think. Um, it wasn't really anything that they were doing that was out of the ordinary. I mean, they were doing what they've what, they, what Leach has done that since the whole time he's been at Washington State. And so um, we were really surprised by that. We just didn't execute the best we could.